We are about to find us something to wear and go get our nails done. I have not had my nails done in ages. I don't even know how long it's been. It's always the hardest part about anything when it has to do with my life. <sighs> Finding something to wear is literally... I don't know. I don't know. I think we're gonna do this. Let's find the rest of the outfits. I think we will wear the toys. Yes. I ain't gonna get my toys done. Now we gotta go grab jeans. They're in the other room. My phone's a little to the side. That's because I cannot get this air stick straight. And honey, I've tried a thousand times. And so as y'all see, my man is back in town. Not him opening the toothbrushes and getting the toothbrush, picking a purple one, the same color as mine. So I really be having to pay attention to the toothbrush before I brush my teeth because I love you and everything. But um, that's a little, you know, a little too close. My husband out of town. He has been back in town for about a week. It's been a week. It's been a week. Might be why y'all ain't seen me. I notice I'm gonna have to start wearing sunscreen because because I'm always outside fully dressed. My face is literally darker than the rest of my body. Like you can kind of see it. That's all I'm gonna show you. But so some skin prep and look. That toner gonna get that dirt on you. We're doing this fast because I, mean, I should have been done. I got up. I did not cook us breakfast. My man cooked us an omelet. It was busting. So I got up and I cleaned up. Right now, I'm washing the floor mats for the bathroom. They're in the dryer. So if you hear all that noise, that is the dryer. So I know it's tax season, but I hate tax season. I do. Like... I have old IRS for the past two years. Do I need to find an accountant to do my taxes? Yes, I do. I need an accountant. I need an accountant to look over my own finances. And I do need a professional doing my taxes. And I also need to start keeping track of everything. I keep track of most, of most stuff, but I gotta start keeping track of everything because I have old IRS two years in a row. So how people be Excited for tax season? I dread it. I wish we could skip Christmas and tax season. That's why I take my biggest L's. Glistening like a honey bun. What is that? Oh, that. <laughs> okay, so he is done. <laughs> Put on my little Cuban on Cuban. A nice little bracelet, just six little rings. I got two earrings in this deck, it's period. One earring over there. We just gonna go get these nails done. <laughs> I don't even know how I want them done. I just know I want them done. Child, I hate how hair gets everywhere. I am finally headed to go get my nails done. I still don't really know how I want to get them done, but I think I know. But I don't really know. But I'm going to make sure it's something easy because I swear I hate how I get my nails done every single time. I can count on one hand how many times I've gotten my nails done and actually like them. So, we're just going to keep them simple, but we're going to get them done, and we'll be back. this vlog thank y'all for going along with me to get my nails done and my toes i am very much aggravated Ugh, i hate being aggravated i hate it so much i think we all hate being aggravated but i hate it like i just want to scream ah that was my little scream but this is my nails i got them red 
they do match my lips but that is not why i got them red my toes are red as well they're the same color red um i'm irritated for multiple reasons but number one i never like the service when i get my nails done and i'm gonna just chop it up to maybe i'm just high maintenance when it comes to getting my nails done but i don't feel like the word high maintenance applies to me in no area of my life so let's take that back because i am not high maintenance i am very easy to please maybe i'm not i don't know but my service it it, it, it it she irritated me because i told her i was like i want them square and i was i want them red and these are not square like these are like Cir like i don't know they like thick these look like these look like veneers you feel me like these are not square i wanted my nails square like a box chevy square okay not veneers this lady put veneers on my nails and like it irritated me and then it's like you can kind of see through something like look at this one you didn't even put that much polish on that one <sighs> and then while she was doing my nails like bro she was just like irritating me but i was being nice because she was nice but she was just still irritating me because like one thing I do love about salons is I can just decide I want my nails done and I can just get up and I can just walk in. So I love that because the people who require a deposit could never, right? So I love that I can just get up at any given time and be like, I want my nails done and they'll fit you in. But what irritates me is you never know the price of nothing. At least when you book on somebody's site, they break down the price. You know what I'm saying? You already know what your price is when you get there, right? You know exactly what you're paying. When you go to salons, you have no idea what you're paying none whatsoever and you have to ask them and then when you ask they be looking at you like oh is she cheap or is she trying not to pay me or is she not gonna give you a tip no i just like to know a roundabout of what it's gonna cost so i'm like you know i was like i want them square i want them like this long i was like how much is that and she was like oh and then she went looking for different nail tips so you know the regular little nail tips the ones that like kind of curve or whatever and then she got the square ones it's like that's flat and she was like which ones do you want and i was like she irritated me then because i don't care about the tip i just want my nails square right so with me telling you how i want my nails you should decide which tips is going to get you what i'm asking for why are you asking me which tips like uh, anyway so she was like which tips so i picked the you know the straight ones because i'm like okay it's less shaping for her and everything it'll be easier right so let me get them so then she like starts falling my nails and everything to put the tips on. And I was like, how much is that going to cost? Did you, did you not hear me when I asked you the first time? Like, did, do you not, is it a surprise? You know, like at the end, like, let's see if you can guess how much it costs. No. So I'm like, how much does it cost? Cause I want us to understand this before you start putting tips on my nails. Because I always come in here and I always end up paying money for my nails and i'm never satisfied like i am never satisfied when i get my nails done and i just need to find somebody who really know what they're doing but the people who be like you know you have the book on their website i just want to get up and get my nails done right i don't i don't want to i don't i don't know if i want my nails done thursday i don't know if i want my nails done sunday like i don't know i want to be able to get up and be like you know what hmm i want to get my nails done today so i don't like going on the website and booking because i just want to spontaneously get my nails done like it's so irritating you have to hmm let's see because if i plan if i book for thursday if i want my nails done and then i'm like okay i'm gonna book for thursday by the time thursday get here it's gonna be inconvenience i'm gonna be ready to get off work and go home like i'm not gonna want to get off work and go over there or then it's like do i set a time where i go straight from work now i'm in these work clothes i'm ready to take a shower now i'm getting my nails done i'm irritated or i set a time where it's like i go take a shower then i come out go get my nails done and then i got to get in the water again because i done came outside like so by the time it's time for me to come to the appointment it is an inconvenience like it's 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 not it, it's not giving luxury it's not giving spa it's not giving relax okay it's gear it's giving hurry up and finish my nails but back to the story because i done ventured off anyways so she's like oh this is that and third she was like 65 so i'm like you know that's decent all right 65 dollars. okay boom she's doing my nails bro and then like she was putting these big tips like the tips she was putting it was like hanging over a little bit so i'm like looking at the nail and i'm like I wanted to be like, why is you putting this big ass tip on my nail? Like, clearly you can see it's bigger than my thumb. Why is it hanging off on the side? And she did that on a couple of them. Like, Usa, calm down. You know, maybe she gonna one two these nails, so we not gonna be petty. Then she start curving and putting these veneers on my hand. I didn't ask for veneers. I asked for square nails, and it's like. I work in customer service, so I try not to be, you know, that customer when I go places. So I'm always, even if I don't like it, like, you'll be able to tell because my de demeanor shifts a little bit, but I'm not going to be rude. I'm still going to leave you a tip. You're not going to get a, as big a tip 
as you would have got if I would have fell in love with my nails. But I'm still going to leave you a tip. I don't know why, but I still left her a tip. And then it's like, I'm getting my toes done too. So I'm like, okay, my toes. And then she's like, she pulled out the bag. And I was like, I just, I don't want them soaked and everything. Like, I just want, I just want my toes painted. You feel me? Because you already irritate me on my nails. So if I get a full pedicure where you scrubbing and then putting hot rocks and everything, this service is going to run me up. And then I'm going to be irritated at the end of the day because my feet going to cost just as much as my hand. And I don't even like my hands and I shouldn't even pay you. Right. So I'm just like, I just want polish. Like just, I just, I just want polish on my toes. I, I don't want to soak. I don't, I don't want my toes to be, I don't want none of that. I don't want a massage. I don't want none of that. Just paint my toes. And everything ended up coming out to $90, which my hands was 65 and I guess my toes for them to paint my toes was $25. Whatever. Okay. So my service came out to $90 and it's like, $90 would not be a lot of money if I loved my nails. If I love my nails, I'd be like, period, honey, 90. Veneers. This is why I'm already cheap. Y'all know that. I don't have to tell y'all that. I, I am cheap and I am frugal. I do not like to spend my money. I'd rather put my money in a bank account and, and log into my app and look at it than to give it away. I know this. But I do not pay. I do not mind paying for stuff when I go out to get something. If I'm going out to eat, I'm not gonna be like, "Ooh, how much that costs?" Uh -uh. No, only one of them. I'm not gonna do that. If I'm going out to eat, I'm like, "Okay, boom, I'm going out to eat. I'm gonna swipe my card." If I'm going to get my nails done, I'm like, "Okay, boom, I'm going to get my nails done. I'm gonna swipe my card." Like, I don't, I don't like to just spend money. But when I know I'm going somewhere to spend money, I'm not gonna be one of those people that's like, "I thought you said it was thirteen, fifteen. Why, why did it say thirteen, sixteen? I'm not gonna do that." But don't charge me for something and then don't don't satisfy me with the service that pisses me off i just do not like how everything has changed so much since i've been gone like i know you have to, to change with the times but it's like oh goodness gracious can we go back to the 25 dollars full sets because if this would have been 25 dollars, i wouldn't even be i would have been complaining i'd be like 25 dollars for my nails no designs and i always get my nails plain because i never like my nails so I don't go in there and be like, ooh, stiletto, put a little curve right here and then put some crystals and then some gems right there. I don't even do that because y'all can't do a basic set. You can't do a basic set. So why would I why would I go in here and try to add creativity to it? You can't even shape square nails. Like you gave you gave me veneers. Why I ask for square? Square. The most simple, everybody knows what a square is. It's not like I came in there and said, let me get trapezoid. And you like trapezoid i said square and got veneers i am very aggravated oh i am i am so aggravated but thank y'all for tuning um tuning in to my vlog and following and going along with me i'm gonna go in here and cook for me and my man we probably gonna have steak we got some steak yesterday steak mashed potatoes asparagus and biscuits that's what we're going to have. So I'm going to go in here and woosah and cook for my man. This is why I don't. Veneers. This lady gave me veneers. Y'all be easy, okay? All right. I love y'all.